In this video figure, we demonstrate Build-A-Tree, a tabletop exhibit that we designed for natural history museums to help visitors learn about evolution and phylogenetic tree thinking. We implemented Build-A-Tree using HTML5 and JavaScript, and we have it running here on a Microsoft Surface. We use a WebSocket layer to pump multi-touch events into a web browser. In this case, Google Chrome is running in kiosk mode. Build a Tree is a multi-level puzzle game. In each level, visitors are presented with a set of organisms and challenged to build a tree showing how the organisms are related. To construct a tree, you simply touch two organisms together. And then, you can drag them apart again to break trees apart. When two organisms are joined correctly, visitors earn a star. Here I've completed this level. In between the levels, we show two trees, the visitor's tree and the scientist's tree, or the solution. In this case, the two trees are identical. We also provide some brief did-you-know text to highlight interesting facts and relationships about the prior level. Visitors can receive information about an organism by dragging it to an information dock at the lower part of the screen. Here we see a short-nosed fruit bat from Singapore. We animate the construction and deconstruction of trees with a simple spring physics model. This allows visitors to rotate trees around branching points without breaking them apart. We also label shared derived characteristics of organisms. In this case, spiders and scorpions are arachnids, and they're labeled with the trait eight legs. We tested our exhibit at a well-known university natural history museum with 79 groups of visitors. The multi-touch tabletop technology allows multiple visitors to interact together and the game-like nature of Build-A-Tree lets visitors use well-established social practices of gameplay to coordinate their interaction with one another.